The runoff election for Denver's mayor is getting ugly. Incumbent Michael Hancock is blasting his challenger, Jamie Gillis, for being what he calls racially insensitive. And it's all playing out in a new television ad. Political specialist Sean Boyd gives it a reality check. Denver mayoral candidate Jamie Gillis was hoping the controversy over her remarks about the NAACP in Chinatown would go away. It's only gotten worse with the release of this ad by incumbent Michael Hancock. Like Trump, she called undocumented immigrants criminals. Not exactly. Hancock is referring to Gillis' response to a question about Denver's so-called sanctuary city policies at a Republican forum. We won't tolerate crime or criminal activity. We will comply with authorities. We will comply with ICE. That's provocative in the current climate, but here's what you need to know. While Gillis says the city should comply with ICE in regard to criminal activity, she doesn't say undocumented immigrants are criminals. And in fact, she says she supports the city's current policy with regard to ICE. It's what she said on a webcast in Five Points that's more difficult to explain. What does NAACP stand for? National African American. Oh. That's true. Gillis didn't know what the NAACP stood for and only marginally what it did. She said it was a momentary lapse. Now Jamie Gillis has deleted racially insensitive tweets to hide her past views. That's also true. Gillis released a tweet 10 years ago under maiden name questioning the value of Chinatowns and held a fundraiser at a Mexican restaurant advertising it as a Tacos and Lowriders event. When the social media posts came under fire, she responded by deleting the post and making all her personal accounts private. Bottom line, every candidate makes mistakes, but Jamie Gillis has made a string of mistakes that suggest she's racially insensitive. And while she's released statements refuting that, more voters will see the release of this ad and make their own call. I'm Sean Boyd. That's Reality Check.